I'm Dr. Andrew Davis. Welcome to the Demo Lab. Today, we're going to be talking about the SpecAC Freeport Liquid Flow Cell. The cell has a fixed path length of 100 microns, with Z and SE windows and a wedged PTFE spacer to suppress interference fringing. The cell itself can be pressurized to 30 psi, which is approximately 2 bar. The cell has three ports. When looking at it from the front, the exit port is on the top left and the two inlet ports are on the top right and the right side of the cell. The right side port is usually sealed with a dead end and can be used for flushing the cell with suitable cleaning solvents. To use the cell for flow experiments, it is usually best to connect a pump to the outlet and have it pull the liquid through the cell. This helps to reduce pressure differentials and to prevent pressure buildups if a blockage occurs downstream of the cell. In the video on the left, you can see different food dyes flowing through the cell to visually demonstrate a switchover in liquids, whilst the spectra on the right show a solution of heptane switching over to a mixture of heptane spiked with acetone. To clean the cell, the third port is opened and then a cleaning solution injected through the cell. Spectra can be collected continuously as liquid flows through the cell. The two inlet ports can also be used simultaneously, with one connected to a switching valve and the other to a cell bypass pre-fill loop. Applications for the flow cell include the analysis of used motor oils that could be incorporated into an auto sampler system. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.